class where you felt it was important to give a thorough evaluation? Um, I think it's thorough to give uh, a thorough evaluation for chemistry because chemistry is a necessary class for some people and by giving a thorough example it will give people like more of an idea of the type of classes they need and how good the class is for what they need for what degree they want. Give a specific example of a class where you felt it was important to give a thorough evaluation. I feel that it's important to give a really thorough evaluation for specifically for instructors because I believe that they deserve to get the credit that they're due. A lot of times that they put in a lot of like time and effort into uh, making a student feel important, an individual, and I think that you should let the school know that they did a good job hiring who they hired. <laughs> Name a reason a student might be reluctant to complete course evaluations and a counter reason why he or she should do it anyway. Apathy will never help anybody to improve. And since I've had a long absence from my last time in college, I've discovered that teachers are also students themselves. And being students, they wanna be the best student they can be. So by providing them with constructive feedback, you're helping them to do their job better and you're also helping them to improve as students themselves. Does that make sense? Yeah, very good, yeah. Very cool. I actually uh, had a teacher who um, was talking about a book that I was extremely familiar with, uh -huh. and he was like really humble to know that he had actually misquoted it, and I was surprised. You corrected him and he was humble about you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah and I was, I was thankful about that, you know. Excellent. Discuss the importance of students having and using a voice when it comes to course evaluations. Yes, the course evaluation is uh, exactly the raising your voice. Sometimes it happens that only one student's voice uh, uh, is not that much, make, makes that much difference. But collective students' evaluation and collecting voice and raising the collective voice makes more difference. For an example, if student is facing some problems uh, about the uh, professor's teaching style or about the assignments or test is, uh, or taste are, and quizzes are more hard and tough, then student may feel has written about that to, to directly speak to that teacher or professor. But when, when in through the evaluation, when this comes as an evaluation, student can give their opinion without being uh, hesitant or, be, or without being biased and they directly can say that what they feel exactly about that profession or exactly feel about that uh, classes. So their voice makes much, much more difference uh, than any other uh, student. So being, a, uh, I, I would say being a student uh, every student has to have give their opinion. It is not only a formality to give about grading. Like uh, if you just uh, if you just make a uh, little bit like yeah, if you feel that it is just a formality, then it is a formality. But if you feel that it is your responsibility being a student to raise your voice, then it it makes actual difference. Give a specific example of a class where you felt it was important to give a thorough evaluation. Okay, um, well I've actually had a lot of classes like this, um, but I think probably the most memorable one was my statistics class and my instructor was absolutely amazing. The material was super easy to understand thanks to how well she was teaching the class. Um, she made projects that I didn't really think I would like actually really fun. Um, so I thought it was important to give her a course evaluation because I wanted her to know how well she was doing and how I really enjoyed her teaching style and how I really wanted her to keep it up.